Welcome back. <laughs> With us now is Kurt Elquist, <laughs> Executive Director, Ransom Lakes Area Tourism Community Enhancement District. It's a long title, Kurt. Yes, I usually try to I'm do a big boy, a I need a big job. <laughs> so yesterday we had this big press conference in Branson that I was so blessed to be at, and we talked a little bit on the show, but we're like, we need to have the real guy in here to tell us the actual details because some things get lost in translation. Mm -hmm. So tell us about yesterday. Yesterday, the Kansas City Chiefs president, uh, Mark Donovan, came down with his crew to um, make it official that Branson Lakes area is the official vacation destination of the Kansas City Chiefs. It is so, so exciting. And it was really cool yesterday to kind of, you know, see that excitement in the room. But like, can you spell out a little bit of what we might see like as residents? Like what's to yeah, come? Yeah, like what does this mean really? It's, it's really, it's not for us here. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. It's to invite the 5 million email subscribers <laughs> of the Chiefs Kingdom. Yeah, absolutely. That's their number. That's a lot. And it's growing. Uh -huh. Invite them to experience Branson and the Lakes area mm. for a vacation destination. Uh, we'll have in-game uh, displays in the stadium okay. where we will honor the uh, military family or the uh, hero, the hometown hero. And third quarter, first time out, oh. the entire stadium stands up. Yeah. And Branson Lakes area is over the top of the stadium. Well, that's it's nice. also on the ribbon board all the way around. Yeah. Uh, we will be engaged in the draft. The draft class will be invited down to Branson for autograph signings and fun of that nature. Mm -hmm. We will be the official draft room sponsor. We will have social media access. We can use their logo in all of our branding wow. wherever we go That's amazing. as the official vacation destination. We will also have access to their um, um, tie in to all their branding that goes on, mm -hmm. preseason TV. We have uh, radio, we have social media. I mean, it, this goes on and on. And then one of the big things I think is gonna be the kickoff party that we, we can use anytime throughout the year. Yeah. And now we're gonna look at it, because the season's already begun, we're not gonna get in the way of that, but we're gonna look at having a timing, having a giant event in Branson mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. to do a big tailgate party or a lot of bit of fun to kick off the playoffs, yeah. to, to drive January and February business to our region, uh -huh. yeah, which, we is, are. which is a, which is a market. <laughs> yeah that we could use some help in Absolutely. January and February in Branson. So we're such a spring break on. Yeah. We'd like to really improve those numbers after yeah. Christmas. Absolutely. Ozark Mountain Christmas is a monster, monster holiday for us, but we come off into January. Well, this Chiefs initiative helps bring new visitors and returning visitors mm -hmm. down for special events and that kind of thing. Yeah. That's so incredible. something I'm like dying to know, because mm -hmm. I feel like people at home are also going to wonder this, like how in the world did this partnership come about or come together? Well, I think we're looking at him right now. <laughs> I mean, that, that, when I saw the, the why don't you two turn around? Yeah. Okay. That'll have a little when, bit to do with it. When yeah. I saw the press release come out, I'm like, Kirk's got to be So it took office. the Lakes Area group, OK, <laughs> and the Branson group, yep. which is very key. OK, you can All sit right. down. Um, <laughs> to come together mm -hmm. for partnership and everybody being unified. Initiated originally in 2019, many years ago, and stayed in communication and I've got a background in building relationships mm -hmm. and sports uh, professionally mm -hmm. and amateur and you know those kind of things and I'm getting old so um, <laughs> I, I've got a lot of relationships that we try to always you know, see if there's a neat win-win-win opportunity yeah. Yeah. there. Now, this has not happened before. I mean, it's not Never. like they've been looking for someone. So did no. you bring this to them originally? Well, one of their agents came through Branson after the Super Bowl in 2019, or, uh, yeah, 19. Uh -huh. And he drove through Arkansas and came up and played golf in Ridgedale and reached out to me and said, hey, buddy, blah, blah, blah. Well, he was from Ohio. I was from Ohio. Mm -hmm. And he now works for the uh, Washington team. He's vice president of sponsorships for them, for the, uh, the commanders. Mm -hmm. But he was with the Chiefs at the time. And we, he and I struck up a conversation. And it just parlayed. Well, he left the organization. Well, Kim Hobbs, who's their vice president of uh, partnerships, mm -hmm. and I stayed in touch over the years. Well, Chris Stathos, who's their new partnership partner for us, and I struck up a conversation and we began dialogue up and down Highway 13, back and forth, <laughs> a lot of texts, a lot of phone calls, sure. a lot of discussions. But this isn't my idea. This is just something I've been, God's given me a gift to bridge people together. Mm -hmm. Yes, he has. And I've been very fortunate to meet good people in my life. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I feel like good people should connect. Yeah. And when the president of the Kansas City Chiefs says, we are as excited about performing for this on the hospitality-oriented region that we are with Branson and the Lakes areas, 
that gives us a lot of pleasure. Yeah, and then, absolutely. And then when the owner of the Chiefs holds up the Super Bowl trophy and says, I want to thank my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And then when you see people pray and, and work through the family faith football like you just had on here. Yeah, yeah. And then when Mark Donovan tells about a story when he came, and then when Clark Hunt sent his children to Canacuck, the owner of the Chiefs. Mm. So there's good synergy because mm -hmm. we're a family-oriented, uh, wholesome, hope, Just hospitality, Midwest values. Midwest, Midwest values. Yes. Yeah, well, when, when the next thing comes, come back and tell us about it. You know, when you're doing the Christmas things, any big party yeah. you're having down there. I want well, to we will, for sure. You yeah. know, th these are the partners that are involved in it. Yeah. The Branson Lakes area uh, is engaged wholly yeah. in this. Yeah. And there'll be retail discounts. There'll be restaurant opportunities. There'll be uh, Red Fridays. We're okay. going to raise money for charities. The Chiefs are giving back to the Little League football program oh, in yeah. our region. So. And I'm missing a lot of the, the, the amenities that come with it because I'm excited to talk to you about yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. But it's going to be really nice when you can see a social media post come out of Explore Branson that says the official vacation destination mm -hmm. of the Kansas That's City huge. Chiefs. That's super exciting. So those are the kind of things. Five-year partnership. Yeah. Five years. Yeah. Just okay. fired up. Yeah. All right. Kirk, we're we just about out of time. wait to hear more. Yes. Thank you for being here. My super pleasure. excited for this partnership. It's yes. going to be a lot of fun. Thanks so. for having Thanks, me. All right. Chief.